Dave here. I'm with Randy Heckman. Randy, what is the biggest mistake that men make today? Well, you ask for the biggest one. We make lots of mistakes as men, of course, but uh, one of the biggest ones is the fact that we think that we need to be in charge, that we need to be, you know, kind of the center of our universe, and, and God's kind of off to the side, and maybe religion's for women, and the biggest mistake we made is, is that we don't see that the strength of a real man is Jesus Christ in that man. The, the reality is, you know, we have, we have men go in two opposite directions. One is they become very passive. They just, because we want to be respected. I mean, that's the way God's wired every man. And uh, so some men just say, I, you know, forget it. Let the little woman take care of the, all the issues, raise the kids, bring them to church. And uh, we become passive. Um, and we're afraid to move in to, to chaos because we don't want to look stupid. So many men just stay there because they don't want to look stupid. And I, you know, I like my best... A uh, biblical example is called Indiana Jones, and uh, joking, obviously, but he's a guy that when there's chaos, he's very eager with courage to move toward the chaos. And they say, well, Indiana, what are you going to do when you get there? He says, I don't know, I'll think of something. Well, we as followers of Christ can say, I don't know, it's like move toward that out-of-control teenager or toward that wife that's mad at me. I can move toward her in love, knowing that the Holy Spirit will give me the words to say. So that's one mistake that many men is that passivity. We've got to fight it. We've got to go toward the problem, men, with guts. The other mistake is that some guys have this false sense of bravado, this macho self, and they go around and push people around. That's, that's, there's fakiness to that. A real man is involved and loving, but also strong. And that alone, the, the Holy Spirit can give to us. So the biggest mistake a man can make is to be separate from God and not trust Him and trust the power of the Holy Spirit in his life.